The Fort Smith Board of Education voted tonight to adopt a mask policy requiring students K through 12 and teachers to wear face masks. Yeah, 5 News reporter Juliana Clipson was at tonight's meeting. She tells us what happened. The decision comes after careful consideration. The superintendent tells me even though the face mask policy will be an adjustment, it's crucial to ensure the health and safety of students and staff. Face masks, the newest item added to the Fort Smith back to school list. The superintendent says he knows the mask will take some getting used to. I think it's just a matter of um, practicing and, and teaching and building up over time. That's what I'm hearing from some parents. You know, it's it's taken some conditioning on our part as the grown-ups. K through 12 students will be required to wear masks during school, school functions, and at any district facility or bus. Along with face masks, the board voted to adopt a resolution allowing the schools to acquire PPE and sanitation equipment. But at the end of the day, the board is prepared to make changes if needed. This isn't the beginning of the end, it's the end of the beginning, and we just have to continue to work on our preparation. Sarah Tomlin teaches at Northside High School. She says preparing for this coming school year has been all about flexibility. Well, we understand that it, there's um, a lot changing. Um, the numbers are changing every day um, and that there are, as discussed tonight, innumerable pathways that we can take. Tomlin says at the end of the day, she has full faith Fort Smith students will adapt to the new policies as best they can. I know that they look out for each other. They look out for their teachers. They look out for for um, their um, older relatives, and I know that it's going to be an interesting year going forward, but I have total faith that we're all going to be on board. In Fort Smith, covering news where you live, Juliana Clipson, 5 News.